Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. So today we are gonna do something a little bit different. We're reviewing a custom content stuff pack and I have never reviewed anything on my channel so hence why it's different and new <laughs> and if this fails big time, I'm sorry. <laughs> but anyways, this stuff pack is made by the Plump Up Tea Society. It's called Rustic Romance so it's basically a cute little stuff pack based around weddings. Um, I saw some pictures of it and I was like, oh, this is adorable. I need to try at least to do a review video because I've never done it before. So we're going to go through some of the items. Um, hopefully all of the items, unless I somehow managed to miss some, <laughs> which wouldn't surprise me. Um, but anyways, we're going to start in Kaz. And I made four little uh, sim models or three grown-ups and one small one <laughs> to show off the new dresses we've got, for example. We've also gotten some male clothing and stuff like that. So we're gonna start out with Mary Lou here, who I gave uh, this cute hair, which is a part of it. It's it's new. Um, it's in the stuff pack. It's adorable with this little side. I don't know what you call that, a ponytail, perhaps curls and this little plant thing. Adorable. I love it. Does it does this come in different swatches? I didn't actually check before. Oh, and my my uh, columns are messing up. That's great. Get start. Okay. <laughs> It does! Oh, this is so odd to me. I love it. Which one? Which one do we want to go for? I kind of like this one. I like this red color on the rose right there. I also do like that one. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, we're gonna, st we're gonna go with this one. <laughs> um, I gave her dress a green color because I thought it would fit the plant mm. in her hair. I don't know what that kind of thing is called, so I'm just gonna call it a, a hair plant. <laughs> These dresses do come in a lot of um, different swatches, which is great because, you know, not every bride wears white. I think it's nice that they added some extra colors. Um, I love these, like, like what's it called? Like, faded, no, baby pink, lavender, and there's this baby blue, and yeah. I, I really do like, I yeah, I think they put in some nice, nice swatches. And then for the shoes that you can't really see, so we're gonna... Take a Ooh. close. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mary Lou. Um, <laughs> please don't demonetize me because of the butt crack. Mm. Anyways, um, the shoes also come in sort of the same swatches. So very simple, but they're very cute and very Maxis match. You know, it's really, really difficult to find Maxis match um, shoes. So that's pretty nice. I don't know if we can see the ring up close, but the ring is also new. Um, it does also come in a lot of swatches. Look, like, this is crazy. Like, I don't even. You got hot pink, purple, blue, red yellow blue like a lot a lot of different swatches i think these kind of fit like color wise you got the baby pink the lavender again i think these fit the dresses uh the swatches from the dresses so that's pretty nice and then you got the the more bold and bright choices down here so as for outfit two this is like wedding wedding dress mm. super wedding dress um this dress only comes in white but it does have some different swatches uh, patterns on the, ah. the upper part of uh, the dress, which is pretty cool. I think it's very cute with this little bow on the back. Um, I really do like this one, I must admit, but I think my favorite is probably this one. I don't know, mm. I really like like the flower embroideries, is that what, it, is that what it's called? <laughs> Step one, I forgot to put makeup on her, but anyway, step one of doing reviews video is to learn to speak English. Anyways, and then we got the veil. Is it called a veil? I, I'm pretty sure. Which is pretty cool, pretty nice. Um, have never seen one of those in real life, I must admit, but I do think they look adorable. I think it would probably fit with other hairs too. Should we try? See? Yeah. Um, it didn't fit with the other hair, which I will show you in a second, but it does fit with some other hairs. Maybe not the space buttons, um, but it does fit. No, not the curls either. <laughs> but you can see, so you can use it with other hairs too, which is pretty nice because you don't want to be stuck with just one hair, even though this hair is beautifully made. Like, wow, okay. There are some seriously good CC creators out there, I'm just saying. So our next model is Sasha Santos, and she's also wearing a new CC hair, which is beautiful i love this kind of hair style i wish i could wear it myself but i don't have curly hair and my hair will not stay curled for very long if i curl it so <laughs> that is not gonna happen but look at it like it's 
gorgeous. I love it. And then the little rose over here, which is um, CC as well. Where is it though? Is it on their heads? Yes. And does also, oh, this is going to be difficult. Does also come in a lot of different colors that fit the dresses. She's got a little jumpsuit. Is that what you call these? Yeah, I think they're called jumpsuits. Jumpsuits. Play suits, maybe? Um... Like a pantsuit? <laughs> I don't know. I do like it. It's very, very elegant. Also comes in the same colors as the first dress that we were looking at. And she's also wearing the same shoes. I think she's wearing a different ring, if I'm not mistaken. I could be... No, she is wearing a different ring. Oh, this one has three diamonds on it. Wow. Yeah, look at it. It's beautiful, beautiful. I would guess these could be kind of like... Um, while this is more of a wedding ring, like an actual wedding ring... These kind of look like engagement rings because they got the diamonds on them. I don't know much about weddings, but I, from what I've seen in movies, that's how it works. <laughs> you get a diamond ring <laughs> when you get engaged and then you get like a band or something. Like a simple ring that you wear every day. Because, I mean, you can't wear a diamond ring <laughs> when you go out, right? Okay. Anyways, for the rest of your life, I mean. Outfit number two. Um, this very, very elegant, but <laughs> kind of casual. Yeah, very funny, Sasha. Anyway. <laughs> Kind of casual um, dress as well, which also comes in the same. I like how they did this because it's white and then it's got different colored bands. Yeah, this elastic waistband. I don't know what you call it. I don't know. I think it's called a waistband. I should really mm -hmm. learn English. It's, oh, it's fine. Whatever. <laughs> I'm a translator and I can't English. Um, and then you get them in the, the other colors as well where the waistband is white instead or sort of yeah, it is white. But I think this one is beautiful, beautiful. Very elegant, but still casual. Like, I could wear this shape at the beach um, with the jacket over so I don't melt or turn into a tomato. You never know what could happen. <laughs> but anyways, let's move on to outfit number three. And I'm not sure the pants are made for women, but uh, they were under women, so... I'm just gonna show them to you anyways. Uh, but this blazer is definitely okay. right for women. It's very, very uh, chic, I would say. I mean, some some women like to wear suits at weddings too. I was actually talking to my boyfriend's mom yesterday and she wore a suit to her daughter's wedding. So there you go. So, oh, what? Oh, that's a boring t-shirt. But I was just like, wait, hold on a second. Where's, ooh, blue and pink together. I'm a fan. <laughs> I'm a fan, but it does come in a lot of different swatches too, which is pretty nice because, you know, I, I'm, a, I'm addicted to my swatches. I like having different choices, so that's nice. <laughs> so our last adult model is Benjamin Burns, and I gave him three different outfits because they put in... Oh wait, I gave him four. Okay. They put in three different tops for males and then a whole, <sighs> like a full outfit. A whole body outfit so they got this jacket um is it called a jacket i don't know we have a specific word for that kind of jacket in danish but you know i i can't english as i keep saying every day <laughs> in my videos but anyways it does come in a lot of nice swatches i feel like some of these would probably go well with um the dress swatches as well so that's pretty nice and also a lot of good choices we're gonna look at the pants <laughs> now um if it would stop bucking on me <laughs> there we go these come in like uh different colors and then with different belt colors if that makes any sense so you got the solid like um as you can see this is more like a brown and then you go over here and it's more like a mm. like a muted brown and then down here there's a gray one and then every like you can get the different color pants with the different color build outs. Do you understand what I mean? <laughs> I like it though. It's good to have uh, different sizes Ooh. and I also really like the fit on the men. Um, I usually put jeans on my male sims when I do make male sims, which is basically never, but <laughs> I can imagine like for a businessman, this is probably a pretty nice look, uh, even though it is for <laughs> in a wedding <laughs> stuff bag. I don't know, okay, I got no male sense of fashion. <laughs> or no sense of male fashion, I don't know, whatever. So we got these boots as well, which was also, uh, Sasha was also wearing those in her third outfit, but I just, I'm just gonna show you the swatches on Benjamin here. Um, so we got the green, blue, black, grayish, red, uh, sort of white cream and then gray mm. so they're pretty nice i think they're very very well made if i may be honest and he's wearing the wedding band ring um 
So yeah, pretty cool. For this one, he's got the new shirt, which also comes with a lot of different swatches. I think these swatches kind of mix, uh, not mix, but fit with the engagement ring, possibly. At least this one. It's very turquoise. <laughs> but I like it. It's kind of... Um, I, I, I almost said hipster, but it's not hipster. I do like it. It's it's casual, but without being too casual. You know what I mean? Maybe not, but... <laughs> I think this watch fits um, the colors or matches the colors in some of the dress swatches. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. And he's wearing a jacket here, which kind of... It's like her jacket here, but that's one that one's close. No, no tie. But um, yeah, pretty nice. I think this is the sort of this is the sort of look I've seen at weddings. Like the the jacket and the tie. I just I don't know. I I really don't know much about male fashion, so I'm sorry. <laughs> But anyways, I'm sorry. I just swapped over to another shirt. Ooh, I like this watch. Like burgundy kind of plum, maybe. Um, maybe we call it plum. I like it. Like red, uh, red, purple-ish kind of color. Yes. Fourth outfit. I love these kind. I have no idea what they're called in English, but I love these. Um, if anybody knows, let me know. Mm. I just, I'm obsessed. <laughs> I think they're adorable. <laughs> I think the pants are the same yeah. as before, but this is a whole, uh, whole body outfit. So they've just added a shirt and those things here that I don't know what they're called and I love the swatches. I went through them before and I just, I love them so much. I, <laughs> I don't know if it's just these that do it, but I just, this outfit is adorable. So yes. And we're going to move on to the little toddler. So here is Malcolm McLaughlin. <laughs> what up Malcolm? He's actually Mary Lou's Son. I don't know. I thought it'd be funny. <laughs> so don't ask me why. But he's wearing a vest kind of shirt with a bow, little bow tie, which is super cute. Um, it comes in different swatches too. I mean, all of them have such nice. Oh, this is so adorable. Okay. <laughs> all of them come in pretty nice swatches, but these are sort of. You see the, the the color scheme they're going for. Not the same. Not like bright. Bold colors, but like muted colors. I'm a fan. I'm not good with bold colors, if you may, as you may have noticed by now. But <laughs> so this is adorable, way beyond adorable. And then he's got some little shorts. I don't know if you call those shorts, but yeah. I'm gonna call them shorts. He's also making a lot of noise right now, but that's okay. You're a kid. Um, and these also come in swatches that fit with the. Luckily, fit with the bow tie. I think mainly fits with the bow tie. Should we check quickly? Um, oh, yeah, see, look, fits with the bow tie. Guess who completely forgot that girl toddlers existed? Um, <laughs> me. No, I just forgot to look through some of the items. So I've made little Malcolm a uh, twin sister who's a toddler right now. And she is wearing one of the dresses that we got with the stuff pack or that you can download with the stuff pack, which is super, super cute. Look at this little, look at this little flower she's got on her. Oh, I mean, adorable. And then there's also another one, which is more like the one in the toddler stuff pack, I believe. Uh, the jumpsuit, if I'm not mistaken. Where is it? Um, that one, I didn't know that's not the one. This one, yes. So that's pretty pretty adorable. Look at this little color. Totally cute. And I'm gonna go see if there's something in the children's section too. So one moment. So I've aged up Malcolm's sister. I think we're gonna call her Mary. <laughs> and there is a dress actually for uh, girl ch children, girl child, girl, girl children, I don't know. <laughs> pretty cute. Yeah. It's sort of like the one for toddlers as well, for girl toddlers with the little little flower hair with on the waistband. Um, pretty, pretty adorable. And it comes in a lot of different swatches too. I think they're the same colors as the adult dresses, if I'm not mistaken. I think so, like the muted, muted colors. Yeah, but very, very cute. Mm -hmm. And yeah. So the boys are also getting two pieces of CC, which this one is sort of, uh, the top is sort of like <laughs> this one, but in a children version. Uh, pretty cute. So I'm guessing it comes in the same swatches too, along with the shorts that are also the same, um, just in children version too. I love this. I seriously love that color. I'm obsessed with that color. <laughs> um, the burgundy, yes. So yeah, pretty, pretty adorable. I 
this fits this fits perfectly okay so i think i'm gonna go into the game now and have a look at the items so i hope to see you in there in just a second all right guys so we're in the game now and i haven't actually gone through any of the items because i well with the clothing i was sort of like making the sims beforehand so i would have to go through all the cc <laughs> to find it so i haven't seen any of this so that's gonna be pretty exciting i think this is a chair if i'm not mistaken uh, what does it say? Rustic romance. Yeah, it's a cheer. Pretty nice. Very cute. Like, this could definitely be like used for outdoors, outdoors areas, like landscaping or something. I could use something like this. This is a very, very simple. Um, I swear we had these chairs when I was growing up in my old house. This is coming pink. Ooh, is this sort of? That's cute. Oh, so we can totally, totally like, if we were making like a, a wedding venue. Yeah, you see what I mean? pretty cool and then they would walk up here okay <laughs> anyways <laughs> and we have another chair which is the dining chair I'm guessing uh yes a dining chair with a cushion I cannot see if that cushion has any patterns on it no it doesn't okay just had to check because it's like the cushion is so oh, I could I could have just like changed swatches you know okay whatever <laughs> remembering that for another time um love that color uh very very dark and rustic nice and then we got the same ones, but in a bar stool um, thing with the same swatches as well. So pretty cool. Ooh, look at the little bows. And also we've been invaded by Eliza Pancakes. What up, Eliza? Could you get out of here, please? Okay. And then this is a bench, I guess. Like a pr prolonged version of this one or extended version. I can't. I don't know. Too much English today. <laughs> No, I'm kidding. I think it's just like a longer version of this one. Um, look at the wood though on it. Ne very, very nice. Ooh, is this a- hold on a second. What? Is this a dining table? <gasps> what? Oh my god. I've always wanted one of these, like a, like a square dining table in the game. I've always wanted one of these. <gasps> It's squared, guys. It's a square table. How does it work? How do they all, all say? I have to check this. Guys, come come eat at the table. Oh, wait, no. Come set the table. Oh, it works. Look at this, guys. Okay, I kind of hate this situation in real life where you're sitting way too close to your, to your um, like, the guy next to you. But, you know, love this. Square table. We need one of those, like, from an actual, like, an actual stuff pack from EA. That would be very nice. But I do really like that one. Look at it. And also look at the texture on it. Okay. Moving on, because we've got way too many things to go through. <laughs> so, can't go in that depth in depth with every single one. Oh, look at this table. It's so rustic. It's so rustic. Ooh, look at this. Is this is that still wood under it? Yeah, it is. But look at it. It kind of reminds me of my old dinner dining table. I was born on that table. Alright, okay. Is this a dining table too? What does it say? Wool's wire spool dining table. So it's like a oh nice and it's for six people not eight like the one from um laundry stuff is oh well, that's for six people too it's pretty nice very, like it very 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 much then we got this table which kind of looks like it looks like the the um, woodworking table does it doesn't it like uh because i know with cc when you make cc you kind of a lot of the time you take stuff from yeah from in the game already and then change it just a little bit because it's really really difficult to make things from scratch and then make them look like they should be in the game um so yeah but this is very very nice is it a bar or a console table what is it contains t 12 small slots oh so we can put stuff on it yes we're gonna keep this so we can put stuff on it and then we got this, which is adorable. I want one of these in the game so, so bad. Like, you have no idea. <laughs> oh, it comes without plants on it too, but I love it with plants on it. Look at it, it's beautiful. I want one of these so, so bad. I don't know, to just like put lots of plants on them. Is this a desk? I think this is a, oh no, it's a, it's a bar. Is it a bar or a desk? It's a bar, okay, let's check it with the chairs. So they sit on this side, and then is it functional? Does it actually work? Maybe, maybe not. Should we check? Let's check just quickly, because why not? Oh, it does! Cool. Okay. Very, very nicely done. No idea how you made that, but then again, I have no idea how you made any of the other things. <laughs> so, anyways. So I'm guessing this is for, um... Oh, yeah, I should probably check the swatches, but I think it comes in the same one as... Yes, it does. Okay. 
And then this is for the wedding cake, which I'm just gonna put on here now. Look at this. Look how cute that is. I mean, okay. The wedding cake just disappeared. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's adorable! Oh, I'm guessing it's because oh you, you can't eat it, so they've kind of just... That's amazing, though. I love it. I love it. <laughs> that's, like, full empty. <laughs> okay, sorry, moving on. <laughs> but they're very, very cute. But this table also comes in the same swatches as the other ones. Pretty nice. And then we got a... Whoa, a tree! <gasps> Look how pretty this tree! Oh my god! It's got fabric on it, guys. It's got fabric on it. Wait, hold on. Can we change? I think the, they got this from the cats and dogs tree. But look how this is beautiful. I, I'm, I'm in awe. This is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Okay. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with this pa package now. <laughs> package? I'm, obs I'm obsessed with this pack. All right. And then we got a little bucket flowers, which we're going to put up here. So cute. I wish I could have flowers like this. Oh, they come in different, like... Hold on a second. So we got these ones. Oh, 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 I love that one. I love this one. And then they come in these ones. Very nice, but look at this. I don't know why I went straight to the plant instead of the flowers. D don't ask me. <laughs> I don't know, I'm a plant person, not a, not a flower person. Oh, I love this. I love everything. Look how pretty this is though. Look at the swatches on this thing. Like, I love this, this color combination. It's very nice, because these are kind of like, no, they're not purplish, but I just, I love, I love them. I love them. The muted colors. I'm a fan. Ooh, very nice. White and pink. Let's put it on top. On the top. Thank you. And then we got a box of flowers. <laughs> love it. Oh, I love these things. I just, we need more plants in the game, so I might just keep some of these plants in the game <laughs> afterwards. Let's be honest, we do need more plants in the game. And then we got this, which is another box of flowers. Can you put those on the... Will that work with the window? Just just curious. Or does it, it go through a little bit? Hmm, should we try just because... I just want to see if it works with windows. Like, I know it goes through a little bit, but maybe we can just ignore that. I mean, that's pretty adorable. Not gonna lie, I'm a fan. Oh, I'm a fan. Is this supposed to be on window? So is that is that what it's? Forest of regrets contains. Nah, I don't know if it's supposed to be on like shelf or windows, but I love it under windows. Very very nice. Maybe we should do a build with this stuff pack at some point. That would be pretty cool. And we got both with the f without the flowers and with the flowers. So that's pretty nice if you don't want to go like overboard a little bit. Um, even though, I mean, <laughs> in my opinion, you can never go overboard <laughs> when it comes to landscaping, as you guys may have noticed. <laughs> I do love my plants. And now we got these, which are three buckets. Uh, do we put plants in those? Or how does that work? Is that like, it could be just before. Contains. Three small shots. Hold on a second. <gasps> what? That's- a, I'm sorry. Did I just yell into the microphone? <laughs> Look at this! That's amazing! So you can like, mix and match as you please. Oh my god, I love it! I love it! You guys are so creative! I don't think they're gonna watch this video, but if you do, you guys are so creative. <laughs> I would have never thought about that. <laughs> okay, and then we got um, very nice uh, curtains that we're just gonna put on the other side. We need, we needed these two. I'm just saying, we needed these two. Well done. You read my mind. <laughs> Honestly, every time I build, I'm like, why do we not have curtains like this? Now we do. They're amazing. Okay, and I think this is what is it? Oh, it's like a cake cake stand. So we got this. We can put it uh, basically so you can put cake anywhere you want to instead of just having to put them on this. Uh, where's the, the other table? That This one. So you can just put like on everything that you like on, a, on another table if you want to. And a smaller one, a lower one. So that's pretty nice too. Then we got, what is this? Uh, cutlery, I think? Yeah. You could put these in like normal kitchens too. Um... Very nice. I used to have my cutlery like that because my my groomie had taken up all the space in the drawer, so thank you for that. <laughs> and then we got, is this, what is this? Hold on a second. Tablecloth. Two times two tablecloth. Hold on a second. Oh, it's because I put stuff on. <gasps> Look at this. This is so pretty. So pretty. Oh my god, yes. 
That is so, so, so pretty. Love it. Love it. I'm obsessed with this stuff pack. I don't know how to, uh, I don't know if I can take it out of my game again. <laughs> and then we got um, this one, which is for a single window or just like a one slot window. And we're gonna change the, this one. Very, ooh, we got without flowers. And then we got like a lot of different swatches with flowers. And we got for two windows or two slot window, but with the same swatches, I'm guessing. Yes, um, love this one. It's kind of Christmassy, <laughs> just, just a tiny bit. And then we got more of these, which I believe is based off of the thing that we got in, um, what's it called, Wreath? Wreath, Wreath, no idea. Oh, the creator name says so under. Yeah, there are a lot of creators in that society, I'm just saying, but they're all so, so good. Like, you have no idea. Well, you have an idea, you can see the stuff. <laughs> Anyways, so I think this is based off of that one from um, the Laundry Stuff Pack, and it comes in this one too, which is more brown instead of like, uh, green. <laughs> okay, and then we got, ooh, is this a sign? Very cute. I mean, this is kind of Scandinavian, I'm not gonna lie. This right here is kind of Scandinavian. And then we got a Simtris DIY mason jar. What does that mean? <gasps> That's not small. <laughs> oh, oh no, I love these. I want these in my house, but I can't because I'm not allowed to do anything about this house. <laughs> um, I'm kidding, by the way. Oh, so you can like put these like, Wait, hold on a second. Ooh, DIY like that, because it's made out of like, oh, this is so cute, but it's made out of, out of like a, some kind of jaw. This is so cute. Does it come in swatches too? Yes, it comes without the band on it too. So even without like, wow, but like different, it's not just color swatches. You see something disappears from it. It's amazing. Like they put more and more stuff on it. I love it. And then this is the sign, but on a stand instead, which is obviously taken from the easel. This brilliant you guys are brilliant and then um because often at weddings like especially if it's like an outdoors wedding you see a um a sign saying this person and this person are getting married <laughs> you know there's a there's a wedding going on here <laughs> and then we got wine because who doesn't love wine um <laughs> actually a lot of people don't like wine i love wine and in different swatches too very very nice i have i'm gonna have such issues taking this stuff out of my out of my game what is this for disaster drapes drapes are a great idea no problem at all such a simple thing can't possibly take a lot of time easy <laughs> i'm guessing i'm guessing this took ages to make is that what you mean <laughs> that's pretty funny they probably made this from scratch which is pretty pretty dang impressive and then we got a lot of different candles, and if you guys have watched my speed builds, you know that I am obsessed with candles. <laughs> I got a birthday present yesterday, which was a candle in like a... I can't... I, I will show you the, the jar on... Um, it's not a jar, it's a glass. I will show it on the Discord channel, because I love it. And this is... Oh, it's probably supposed to be on the ground. No, you can place it on, on tables too, but look at this thing. I love all these candles, guys. I love them. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I want them in my life. <laughs> I can't really put candles anywhere, so I put them in my game. Everywhere in my game, basically. But this is nice. So you got these swatches, and then you got them without the flowers and the same colors, and then you got them without the green stuff at the bottom. Again, the same colors. I like this one. I don't usually like gold, but this is pretty nice. And then it's like a rustic gold. And then we got um, lamps. Oh, these are great. These are great. They'd probably be good for like a medium height wall, I'd say. Maybe if we do like this. Oh, let's just raise them up and pretend that it works just fine. Yes, there we go. Worked out just fine. <laughs> so nice. I love these little flowers they put on everything. It makes like everything very coherent. I love it. And then they come in different swatches too. Pretty, pretty nice. I like this swatch. And then there was one more item and then I think that's about it. Um, what is the last one? <gasps> a chandelier! Oh my god. The ivy on top of it? Love it. I just, I love it. So well done, guys. Okay, anyways. So that's pretty, pretty beautiful. Pretty, pretty beautiful. <laughs> very, very beautiful stuff pack. Custom contest stuff pack. I don't even... These guys are, these guys are crazy. Like, how do you, how? 
Can you teach me? <laughs> teach me. Teach me everything, please. And Eliza, Jack, just Jack. get out of here. <laughs> Anyways. So yeah, guys. That was it. Um, the Rustic, Ro Rustic Romance stuff pack made by Plum Bub Tea Society. Beautiful stuff. Every single piece. Very, very impressed. Um, I will leave a link to the, the download post in my description down below. And let me know what you guys think. And also, if you want me to make a build with these items, because... I am slightly obsessed, as you may have noticed. <laughs> so yeah, let me guys know what you think about all the stuff, and I hope you like this video. Remember to like and subscribe and all that good stuff if you did, and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye-bye!